I must be imagining things. Let's just move on! Oh, hi, Dr. Wiley. Nice to see you. That's what I was forgetting. Right! Wiley Stage number one, probably one of the most remembered theme musics for the Wiley Stages. Certainly one of my favorites. Is it my favorite? No. But it's up there. There's just other endgame themes that I like more. Like Counter... Counter Hunter stage from uh, Mega Man X2. The first theme, not the second one. Which is oddly called Sergei's theme when uh, you don't fight Sergei's on that stage. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. Also getting our little Metal Blade uh, happiness out. Because it's freaking Metal Blade. It's got to use the weapon. Ooh. Why, thank you. Uh, now for use of item 3, because it doesn't really get much use in this game. Really, that's probably one of the two spots where you want to use 3, because you can't use something else instead. Case in point, I'm not even going to bother refilling 3, I'm going to refill 1 instead, because 1 is more useful. You hardly ever want to refill a, that one, so... Ah, just in the right spot, so let's fire away. Ah. Oop! Okay, next we'll need item one. Okay, bam! And then bam, and one more to do the trick, and let's move. Hey, Tellies, how you doing? So the first boss we had in the Wily Sages last time was Yellow Devil. So who are we facing next? Red Seraphim? Okay, it doesn't have to be red, guys. I was just picking a color. And red was the first color that came to my mind. Hey, Mecha Dragon! Just so you know, this is an auto scrolling segment. So, first boss, Mecha Dragon! Yeah, I saw that tackle coming. Oop, there we go. Now, he's really not having a weakness. Quick blades. Quick boomerang just works probably better because it rapid fires. Also, that screen flicker. Right! Pause game. Oh, hey, we're back. Uh, yeah. Remember, like the last time, I'm putting save states in between stages, not in the middle of them. So what you're seeing is a live save stateless run. Live, because, yeah, I'm actually recording live. Yeah, we'll give you some three. There, are you happy? No, don't care. Bye! And jump! Oh, hey, lots of goodies. 
With that, we should be full on E-Tanks if I... Yep. So we're gonna just go ahead and refill quick. And then put the rest into two. And then with that... We're basically good on what weapons we are going to need... Yes, made it. We're good on what weapons we were going to need. Everything's filled. And we don't need any more two. There's a couple spots where two is useful, but we don't need a full item number two. So I'm just going to ignore all of these weapon energies as we fight more moles. Because I sure love moles! We done good. Let's go ahead and switch over to item three. The second spot where we're gonna have to use item three, and probably the last. Alas, poor item three. I knew him well. Why am I still using it? There we go. That's the weapon I need. Wow, that was interesting. And that was a close call. There's my platform. And a little more this way. Perfect. Oop. Time for the next boss. Pico Pico Master. Um, what? Yes, that's his name. Pico Pico Master. A lot of people will use metal blades for this fight. Because... You can aim it. I prefer the uh, bubble lead because it just one-shots him. Metal Blades, it takes three hits to kill. So, use Bubble Weed. Yeah, I can't exactly hit left and right at the same time. Okay, time for this somber music. It's just really depressing. So let's go ahead and refill Bubble a little bit. Uh, how's everything else looking? Not bad, we don't need anything else, so I'm just gonna go ahead and equip quick boomerang. To show something off. We're approaching the iconic Dr. Wily spike shaft. But before that, it's a giant fish. It's worth noting that no other weapon does damage the giant fish. Only a quick boomerang does! Which is really odd. Anyways, here's the iconic drop shaft reused in Mega Man 9. Endless mode, that is. And with that, we're already done. There's going to be a lot of those in the series later on, just having to fall with instant death spikes surrounding you on all sides. Hey, crazy cannon. Not so crazy anymore. Ow. Yeah. Okay. Next weapon. Time for... Guts Dozer. Uh-huh. Hi, Guts Man. Why are you back in this game? Gutsman will either shoot at you, or summon mess. He also has tank treads, which is, you know, kind of hilarious. You know, now that I think about it, 
All of his incarnations after the first one used tank treads. Well, at least in the classic series. Wait, are we already done with this stage? Again, it's pretty hard to hit up and down at the same time. Wow, that was a short stage. <laughs> 